guys, are you okay? Great! Do you like songs? Today we will learn a song. Let's watch. Come with me. The doctor song. Hello, Dr. Foster. What's the matter with you? Did you like the song? Yes, it's great, okay? Now, please, open your book, Learn With Us, at pages 4 and 5. Let's go! Yes! There are the pages, number 4 and 5. I want to look at this picture, okay, here. Look! We will do number 5. Hoje nós vamos fazer a página 5, ok? The first thing, the song, ok? Nós assistimos, ok? We watch it and listen to the song, ok? And now we will do the exercise number 2. Listen, point, point means apontar, ok? And sing. This is the lyrics of the song. Essa aqui é a letra da música, ok? And, à medida que nós formos escutando as dores, nós vamos é, apontar, ok? Point and sing. Let's go. Are you ready? Let's start. Let's go. Listening 11. Listen, point, and sing. Yes. Hello, Dr. Foster. What's the matter with you? Now, 
the song to me. Okay, listen and repeat. Hello, Dr. Foster. What's the matter with you? I've got a headache and a cut too. Toothache, earache, a stomachache too. We are at the doctor's. Get well soon. Great. Okay. Hello, Dr. Foster. What's the matter with him? He's got a temperature. And a cough, too. Number three, okay? Estrofe number three. Hello, Dr. Foster. What's the matter with her? She's got a headache. And a cold, too. Very good. Now, let's listen more on time and sing. Let's go. Okay, more on time. Listening 11. Listen, point and sing. Only sing, okay? Hello, Dr. Foster. What's the matter with you? Now, let's do the exercise number three. Look, match the words and pictures. Ok? O que é para fazer, gente? Match. Relacionar, ok? The words, these words, ok? These uh, red words, tá? With the pictures here, ok? Look, we've got a headache. Headache is number, yes, number seven. And a cut. Which number is a cut? Class, Looks. look, a cut is number three. Oh, no. Number three. Cut, a cut. And now, class, two fake, two fake. Which number is two fake? Look at the child, look at the kid. Yes, two fake. Two fake, number six. Six. And earache, earache 
Which number is earache? Earache. Look, number five. Earache. And stomach ache too. Stomach ache. Number eight. Very nice. And we are at the doctor's get well soon. Great. Now the number two, strophe number two. He's got a temperature. Temperature? Okay. It's not he, it's she, okay? But this is only the song, okay? Uh, number four, temperature. Number four. And a cough. <coughs> Which picture is a cough? A cough. Sorry, a cough. Number one, a cough. Number one. And the last, a cold. Which number is a cold? Number two. Oh, I'm sorry. Number two. That's it. Okay. Let's let's correct. Look, number one, a cough. Number two, a cold. Number three, a cot. Number four, a temperature. Number five, earache. Eric, okay. Number six, toothache. Look, toothache. Number seven, headache. And number eight, stomachache. That's it. This is the exercise number three, okay? Before we go to exercise number four, I want to explain something for you, okay? Let's go. Class, what's and what is? They are the same, okay? What's is the contracted form of what is. Both are the same thing. As duas coisas tem o mesmo significado, ok? What, what's, é a forma contraída, mas é o mesmo que what is. Podem ser o que ou qual, ok? Great. Next, look at this, this question. What's the matter with you? Qual o problema com you? Você. And you can answer. Você pode responder. I've got a cold, for example. Or I've got a headache. Ok? Mas você pode responder dessas duas formas. Olha só. I've got a cold. Ou I have got a cold. Olha só. Esse I've. É a forma contraída de I have got a cold, ok? Both are correct. As duas formas estão corretas. Mas, mais comum é o quê? I've got a cold. Very good. And look at, look at the other sentence. What's the matter with him? The question. What's the matter with him? What's the matter with... A boy. Quando tiver him, vai ser com ele. Qual o problema com ele? Aí, podemos responder. He's got a cold. But this his é a contracted form de he has. He has got a cold. Então, he's got a cold. Tá? Or he has got a cold. Cold, ok? And what's the matter with 
her. Ok. Se for her, qual o problema com ela? About a girl. Ok. What's the matter with her? Podemos responder. She's got a cold. Or she has got a cold. Forma contraída, she's got. She's, ok? E forma sem contração, she has got. Ok? Então, entenderam? Aqui os dois, a mesma coisa, tem o mesmo significado. O, a diferença é que aqui está contraída, she's got, she's, ok? E aqui está she has, forma sem contração. Ok? That's it. Now, let's do the exercise number four. Let's go. Number four. Listen and repeat. Listen and repeat. Mas antes de escutarem e repetirem, a Miss quer explicar para vocês o que está acontecendo. Ela escolheu uma das doenças da, das nossas páginas, 4 e 5, tá? Dessas doenças, desse, dessa picture que nós temos. E ele vai tentar adivinhar quem é, se é boy or girl, e qual é a doença. Ok? Então é isso. Now, let's listen and repeat. Let's go there. Listening 12. Listen and repeat. Is it a boy or a girl? A girl. a girl. What's the matter with her? What's the matter with her? She's got earache. She's got earache. Is it number five? Is it number five? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. That's it. And exercise number five. Play guess. Jogue de adivinhar também, faça o jogo de adivinhar. Escolha alguma doença e crie perguntas e respostas, ok? This is the idea of exercise number five. And this box here, esse quadrinho aqui, eu já expliquei para vocês lá na, nos slides que eu, que eu mostrei para vocês antes do exercício 4, tá? Lembra lá? What's the matter with you? What's the matter with him? Or what's the matter with her? Ok? Do you remember? Ok, that's all for today. Bye-bye!